Hello everyone, welcome to the Hot Stocks show that will go into the biggest names that I have on the watch list. Starting with the first one, AMD, AMD that uh, today finally uh, hit new all-time highs, uh, all the way into 96.37. So it was a very nice run since 79 dollars when i got uh, uh, shares here in the long portfolio i trimmed uh, uh, 25 percent of my position on tuesday i trim another 25 percent here on uh, uh, wednesday so i'm basically with 50 percent of the size going into next year where i expect the stock to go all the way above 100 dollars so uh, but after such a strong move it's wise to trim profit so we have a big explosion up big day ignition candle we have follow through we have new eyes but as i expect well we had also some profit taking so uh, i received uh, some questions if uh, uh, i was going to short amd no i'm not going to short amd but that does not mean that you cannot have shorts yes we can have we had on the past several shorts several shorts that work very well for one two three days so here giving the trading plan if you want to uh, try a short needs below 90 to 50 below 90 to 50 you can have Two three dollars downside for 89.4 that's the first support below that we have 85 87 as key levels so um just to uh, stay open mind but i'm not uh, uh, going to risk here i'm not looking to risk any short here anytime soon okay um activision um continues to see some bullish options activity he was able to recover all the key moving hours but still not able to hold above $80, okay? So we need some time, some patience. Uh, the bull case keeps intact while the stock above $77. I'll be bearish only below $77 for a, a move back into the 74. Otherwise, waiting for the break. Break needs above $80 for a go uh, all the way into 82. So keep it on your watch. Uh, Baba, uh, it's starting here to, uh, after uh, uh, three, actually four down days, and I'll be looking next couple of sessions for a possible reversal bounce up and a scalp, okay? The gap here was already filled we have 252 as possible support uh, but we need stock below 260 dollars otherwise what i'll be looking possible red to green move here for a scalp long with the 267 as possible support so keep it open-minded here for a move on baba by the very nice bullish action uh, after last week bullish reversal candle i told you yesterday that i was not chasing the move but it seems that the stock found some more traction they went two three four five days on a row going up back basically to uh, uh, recovering all the pullback that we had here from the reversal cell okay so the action plan worked very well uh, we are getting near 144 the stock can go all the way into 148 148 147 was the level that reverse sell down uh, so all these area here can act as big resist so if you uh, got long trim your profits on the way up raise the stops but the stock was able to regain the momentum above 138 so keeping the ball on the bull camp for now Firstly, continues to see bullish options activity today. Uh, they try to push below the, all the key moving average, but we had a bullish reversal candle here. Now needs some confirmation. Needs above 82, above 82. Watch out. Looking for a move into 1995 dollars there in the next couple of sessions. So stay open minded for a move here on Fastly. Uh, Lift today finally had the break higher. It was one of the dames that um, uh, I highlighted. They push it below the item of Niamh, push it back above, above $40. Big squeeze up all the way above $40.41 and going into the highs, closing above $43 into the close. So, congratulations to all the loans, to all the, uh, everyone that had the patience here to hold. Very nice momentum here, very nice upside. So, now what? Um, on this move, the stock was up uh, more than 9%. On these big moves, you trim profits, okay? You, you And you raise the stops. You should have trimmed at least one third of the position before the market close, uh, or half of the position before the market close. And uh, tomorrow, if the stock goes above 439 
uh, we can extend all the way uh, into 45, 46, yes, but it's risky to chase here. So manage your risk wisely, raise your stops, even to your stops you'll get it, but you keep riding the momentum while it lasts. Nvidia, today I got uh, some calls uh, out of the gate, some calls got in, got out, locked the profits and uh, uh, very happy with um, uh, with uh, with the trade and um, uh, now what needs above for uh, 550 okay 550 550 is the breakout area for a move all the way into 570 dollars okay so keeping open my recover the bull case very bullish case right now while the stock above four to five four to five is my support if it breaks below four to five we have 515 dollars we have 505 we have 493 as possible support but we need to break it price is above so keeping the bull case uh, the bull case pretty much intact pd one of the names that i also highlighted today very nice big ignition candle trying to break higher bounce perfectly from uh, the 21 day moving average also the big support level pushing back above recover the ATA and closing near the eyes now what needs above 145 above 145 keep seeing bullish options activity on the name so looking for a possible move into new all-time highs above 155 so keep it uh, on your watch and another one uh, peloton today it was a uh, beautiful out of the gate got into calls uh, locked very nice profits on those calls bounce from the 8 day moving average uh was looking for a gap filling the gap was not filled and we actually saw some fading that's a yellow flag for the bull case we need above 118 to go and fill the gap at 122 so bears were able to strike and push price slower so what's the action here not looking to have any new position unless i see a uh, possible for a gap filling Gap filling needs above 118, gap fills at 122. Bear case scenario needs below 107, below 17, watch out, can go back into 94, 95 dollars area. So keep it on your watch. Twitter, another name that uh, I've been mentioning, once again, is start filling the gap, but uh, they have been pushing price. We also hit 48, very near 48 dollars. It has been a big wall. Bull case scenario needs above 48 to resume back up. Uh, staying bullish while price above 45 46 dollars and uh, i will only be bearish if price breaks below 44 for a move into 42 dollars there so congratulations to all the traders uh, jd um, has been seeing with the baba sam selling pressure uh, a control pullback in my opinion right into the support level fill the gap now what? Um, I saw some bullish options activity. Believe that the stock, if it goes above 86.5, should go back into $90 there. So keep JD on your watch list. So those are the biggest names that I have on the watch list. Thank you all for watching. Wish you all good trading and stay safe. Bye bye everyone.